Okay, folks, we're going to try another day. Let's see if I can get this done here. Uh, what day are we on? We are on March 3rd. <coughs> Excuse me. I was not prepared. i got to turn my, my thing on here. Here we go. We are doing a Steampunk Series 1 by Trisha Long called Fan Blades. Uh, no glare. got to change my direction of my thing here. So, let's get that all opened up there. <coughs> so this one looks like it'll be fun. Let's see. It's by Trisha Long. Looks like step number one, we do some concentric circles. So there's going to be two smaller ones in the inside and then a bigger one. And then within that bigger one, we're going to make some U-shapes. Like that. And then on the outside of the circle, we're going to connect those U shapes with sort of a triangular ish shape. Doesn't look too hard. And then on one side, oh, pardon me, on one side of the blade, we're going to thicken up one edge, one of the long edges. Of the blade and we're going to put a little bit right in there. I don't know if you can see that. Can you see that? There's also a little bit right in there. To give it some 3D-ness. And then we can embellish as we would feel lead. This one's got some rivets and some movement lines which I like. That's this one. Or this one with some uh, fake wood looking grain Thing happening there that's kind of hard for you guys to see but if I zoom way in maybe you can tell see and um, let's just play with that and see what we come up with I'm trying to figure out oh 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 pardon me wow where'd they yawn come from uh, trying to figure out if I want to just do one big one in the middle and just leave it at that or if I want to try to overlap them I'm gonna try I'm trying to, I'm gonna try a I'm gonna put one here and maybe one in that general area something like that so, in the middle of this one, I want to do a circle, and then inside that circle, I want two more circles, like that. And you are too far away. Let me zoom you in. There we go. And then, within this, I want to make these U-shapes. Don't think it matters how many there are. I might be a little too far apart. But whatever. Okay, so U-shapes. And then on the outside, we're going to do sort of a triangular-ish shape. We're going to come up, kind of come over and down. And then I'm going to go up and over and down. And then up and over and down. And up and over and down. My fan has gone through a lot. I got some dinks and binks on it. That's what's happened to my fan. It's not straight. I'm going to put some bolts. Oh, 
kind of small. Okay, so I'm going to double up that line right there, make it a little thicker. So far so good and then I do I do like this sort of spinny look that this ends up with go across that edge slight curve really light pressure on my pen Some closer together, some farther apart. Give this guy some movement. Something like that. That's cute. Okay. So now I'm going to put one in this general area. I feel like, oh, I didn't do this part. There. Well, I feel like that one was almost too small. My base was not quite right there. Start with ones that aren't going behind and I'm going to come up and over and down, come up and over and down, up and over and down, up and over and down. This one's a little, little less dinked with my fan blades. Over and down. This one's going to go up and it just going to go through there and you don't see that. And this one's going to come up and here and down like that. Okay. This one needs I could do circles there and make sort of circle rivet, but I chose not to. It's your thing. You can do whatever you want with it. Right? Let's make that one thicker. Right along there. Go up and around the corner.
Okay. Um, you're a little too close now. You were too far away. Now you're a little too close. Okay. And then on this side... Something like that. And I'll do that in here. You know, I almost feel like they're steampunk flowers. So I'm going to give them screw-like stems. And maybe a bolt stem. I'm just really don't know what I'm doing here. Just adding something that feels like it needs to be there. My rivet leaf. There we go. I've I've made them into a sort of a bouquet. Why I did that, I don't know. This was called fan blades. Okay, I'm gonna get rid of all of that pencil. Stuff going around the edges here. Don't need that anymore. Give her a bit of shading. Let's see, that would go up in there, that would be overlapping here, right? And some would be overlapping here, and here. And then, perhaps I'll do a little bit in here. connected and maybe a little something something here on these bolt thingies I'm not sure 
And that one's overlapping a little bit. And then this is overlapping here. With a little bit going this way. Okay. Blendy, blendy, blendy with that. blendy in there, blendy blendy in here, blendy along there, along Good enough. I think she's done. There we go. There are some flan blades. A little bit of steampunk. Put it in the steampunk series. That was easy to do. I am so excited that I can move along again today. Oh, it's been a long week. All right. So I think I'm finally caught up with everything. I'm on schedule again. Um, I hope you guys are having a good day. I will see you tomorrow. Uh, don't forget to do something nice for somebody else because that makes the world a better place. And I will see you later. Bye.